Hey, hey, no, 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 no. Oh god. Uh, no, friend, just checking to see if anything is new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry. I'm sorry. Oh god. I'm just gonna unequip everything. And we're gonna keep only the essentials. And we're gonna see what we can get out of Tamberlane here. Alright, alright, alright. Right. Uh. Why well, can't tell me about Terminor? I just said you'd be able to help me. What do you know? Well, some say I know everything. What would you like to know? Whatever's important, Jim Keeper. Uh, Tamberlane and Mega Esquire. And yeah, see, we're back right into the loop. Uh, this is the one that leads to the shop, so we'll just do that for now. What do we want to get? Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, we're gonna keep the Chaos Mall. Uh, I don't need this Chaos Staff. Yeah, I don't need it. Uh, we're keeping the Chaos Thorn. I've got a lot of ropes. Uh, Falaron's gonna be learning Wall of Bones, and I don't really need the Wand of Wall of Bones. Yeah, we can get rid of that. Uh, Stormbreaker to keep or to remove. I kind of want to keep it. It has some utility that is useful. I can sell some ropes. Uh, I'll sell... Well, hold on. Do you have any hold items that I want? It doesn't look like you do. You've got Unseen Shields. I'm definitely going to want those. Oh, oh, they're kind of pricey. Eh. Everything's kind of pricey. Decisions. Decisions have been made. Just come back next episode, guys, okay? <laughs> you can leave the video now. It's probably going to be over before anything interesting happens. Uh, I don't really care about this. I don't need this anymore. This is garbage. Mm, ST gem, haste amulet. Do you have an amulet that I want? You've got the shield amulet. That's a pretty darn good amulet to have. Uh, I kind of want to keep a butterfly and ST gem, though. And I'm not super interested in buying the shield amulets. I don't feel like I need to, don't need the devil one anymore. And the haste amulet is honestly quite garbage. We keep our homes and defenses. How do I not have more Marari cloaks? What happened there? Do you have Marari cloaks? Can I buy some? You don't. I'm pretty sure I can get them somewhere else in town. I'm gonna sell these lily cloaks. Uh. And you, uh, this has all our gloves covered right now. Uh, we've got our one belt of life and three mercenary belts. We've got four boots of adamant. We don't need this. Or this, or this, or this. Scorpion shield is garbage. I want more unseen shields. I'm gonna take three, no, two. Only need two. Uh, Anything else I can pawn off? Not really. Kind of need everything else I have. So we've got our two shields, our four armors, our four belts, our four boots, our four gloves. I need to buy more Barari cloaks somewhere else in town. Got our four helmets. We've got two amulets, but I'm not worried about the other amulets that I sold. We've got four holding items. We've got a sword, a throwing weapon, and a hafted weapon. And, okay. We've got all the gold we're going to have to work with here. What else do I want? What all do I want from here? Uh... Hmm. Did this get more expensive? <laughs> Was it less last time? I kind of want to get one of these, at least. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? We'll get one of each of these. If, can I even afford 28? 30, that's 39. Oh, uh, yeah, I should be able to afford all three. One. Two, three. Oh my god. It's actually that pricey. Oh, I'm off by like the tiniest bit. Okay, hold on. I have to sell one of my belts anyway. Eh. Is that enough? No, I cannot afford it yet. 2891. Uh I can sell some regions. Their value is three. Okay, I sell one. The shield damage is twenty eight ninety one. That's ninety one minus fifty eight. That's uh it's about ninety nine minus sixty, so it's roughly thirty. So if I sell ten of these I should be... okay... Oh, and I need a little tiny bit more than that. Wow, that herb is so inexpensive you won't buy it off of me. <laughs> there we go! We're broke! <laughs> but we got all our stuff. Isn't that amazing? Okay, uh, if you're still here watching this somehow, we're gonna cover the rest of this dialogue and just, like, end the session there. And we'll cover the rest next time. I don't want to put anything too interesting after that crap I was just doing. You mean the wild man of the bog? 
Uh, I think so, yes. It's a myth. I mean, yes, there is a man who lives in the bog and people often comment on his strange ways, but... You wouldn't be exactly normal if you'd suffered the loss of your wife and then spent the rest of your life fighting your daughter. What happened to his wife? Mago killed her. Mago? When he first went crazy those few years ago. Before his wife shut him up in that room, she was, has, you know, in the middle city, I think. In the city? I see. How did Mako go crazy? I don't know. No one does. I've never trusted sorcerers, let alone the ones that go mad. I don't ask too many questions about him. And this Mago killed the wife of the wild man in the bug? Yes, and she died horribly, if I might add. The poor man wasn't the only one to lose a loved one, but others seem to have dealt with the tragedy a little more easily. It's a sad story, anyway. Thanks for the information. Whatever's worth knowing, for instance. I heard there were some trolls nearby. You know, there are trolls in the hills set to the south. Rumor has it they go at a bridge which allows travelers to follow the old coast road. I know I, for one, would pay handsomely to have those trolls removed once and for all. They're ruining the tourist trade. How does one find these trolls? You only head southeast towards the desert. You'll find them, or they'll find you. How much would you pay? Well, that would depend on whether you killed them all or left a few. We'll see when you return, if return you do. Oh, well, I'll return, don't worry about that. That's another little side quest. Hold on, there's more we can get out of you, Tamberlane. Ah, <laughs> oh, excuse me. Blah, 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 let's get to the floor. Where is it? It's right. Hellron says something. Okay. Uh, aren't there some Chandra ruins outside of town? Oh, to the north, Tominor is built upon the ruins of a Jundar city. There are battlegrounds around here where they say the ghosts of Jundar still walk at night. The people of Tarmar don't seem to like the Jundar much. They slaughtered many of us. They are blue-skinned butchers. Do you know about the Jundar city in the desert? I've heard stories about it, but I've never been there. Do you know where it is? Not really. The desert's just south of here. But there's some kind of magical barrier that keeps humans out. Some Jundar mystery. The magic's different from ours. Different how? I don't really know. As I said, I don't know much about them. I just tell you what I hear. Whatever's worth knowing, for instance. Wasn't the famous battle fought here? Oh, Lear's victory. I know it. At Darkling Hills. My great 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 granddaddy fought in that battle, you know. Lear had tricked Zaratus into following him into a trap. We humans had figured out the Jundar magic and were waiting for him, east of here, beyond the bog. Was our magic that much stronger than theirs? It was on that day, and now it always will be, son. That's how we humans were first drawn together. But Terminor is not part of Wernie now. Even good things fall apart. Someday, maybe, you'll join us again. We can smash those Jundar once and for all. We'll see. Goodbye. Goodbye, Tamerlane. Goodbye. What is it, Squire? You look like you've seen a ghost. There's been a massacre. What? A massacre! I've seen the survivors! What? What survivors? What are you saying, lad? Poem. Poem has been burned to the ground. But I have friends in Poem. I... No! No, I don't believe you! What massacre? It's nonsense! The necromancer has burned the whole city. Stop fooling with me, lad, and I'll thank you to watch your tone with me! Massacre! You come in here with your six stories and your wild ravings? You don't know what you're talking about! Think what you're saying! Poem is gone! Be quiet! Not one more word! Help! Please! Alaron, over here! Alaron! Oh, look at her! She's standing, looking perfectly normal. Incredible! Help! Me. By the spirits. Help me, please. Hold still. Please. I'll help you as best I can. But it's not possible. That's just what I'm thinking, innkeeper. Ask what happened. Friend, uh, leave her alone, Aleron. She's barely alive. Ask. I want to hear it. I want to hear it again and again. I want to know. Friend. Monsters. They came from nowhere. We had just turned in for the night. My, my son woke crying, saying he heard noises. You're a brave woman. Freya, are these wounds going so grave? Look, Elrond, the way she breathes. She lets her life go by herself. Try. There's nothing I can do. Friend, rest easy. I can help you. Boy, are you a knight? Someday. We need you, boy. These creatures from a nightmare everywhere and this wizard by them, and the staff. 
in a mist I called, no answer. Next, the drums I heard loud booming, like the heartbeat of some beast. Shapes. Shamsuk? Alaron, don't excite her. You know it was him. Boy, someday it will be your turn, son. Don't talk. That thing, awful. Why? Squire! Tell me why. A boy, a young man. Punishment. Rabbisat was talking. Then they struck me. Someday you attack. I will. You know. You know now. Tell me about the staff. You are a knight. Lady? And now you know. Tell me again about the wizard and his words. Don't question her so. Let her talk. Boy, don't let us down. Miss? Miss? Lad. She's fallen. She... No more, lad. She's gone. I had many friends in home. Please go outside. Let me take care of her. Very well. Thank you. But the scene's not over yet. I wonder if we'll meet any more survivors. Leaving so soon? I don't remember what voice I gave him. Neeson! Happy to see me. Have you heard? About your progress with this curse? Don't worry. I'm not expecting any miracles. She's done her best. It's a difficult spell to break. Forget the curse. That's not why I'm here. Not everything's about me, you know. What are you doing in Terminor? I think that's obvious. I'm running from Pome, like everyone else. Or haven't you seen the survivors? There was one just now. You spoke to her? She described the minions. She couldn't name the wizard. Oh, but you know who she meant, don't you? Were you there? Almost to the end. Remember? I was visiting my father, my mother, our friends. I'm sorry, Neeson. Were they all lost? Every one of them. Whoosh! Up in smoke. How did you escape? A premonition. Feeling. Maybe it's the curse. Somehow Shamsuk and I remain connected. I noticed him in home and kept myself at a distance. I heard he was questioning the miners and the wives especially. Odd, isn't it? And this went on for hours, but on the fourth day, he asked nothing, and I felt his judgment gathering, and I ran. I ran quite early. Too bad I chose to turn and look back at the fire. This puts such wild thoughts in my head. Forget them. I don't want to forget them, Squire. Thinking about getting even? I have had some thoughts. You'd better think again. You know, I don't understand the knighthood anymore. You'll do anything for honor, fight any demon, yet you turn your back on a friend. I'll go. Brenna! Smart girl. She's not going without me. And then I guess Alaron's coming too, because I, for one, have no intention of letting this wizard or magician or whatever he is get away with this! Count me in too. It's time someone showed the necromancer where, we're, or where we draw the line. Squire? Why ask, Neeson? You bring up the dead, you persuade my wizards, you offer me power. What choice do I have? I've been I've been thinking about Pome myself. What about you, Squire? Are you up for the quest? Or do you still want to run around trying to perform your personal little mission? I'm with you. My idea is simple. We go into the bog and attack the tower. It's still unfinished. When the tower is destroyed, we attack the necromancer himself. Yes, agreed. Magicians first and foremost. Now look. You fight magic with magic, Squire. Whatever you say. The tower is magically locked. But I've researched a way, and I think I will work. Uh, we take magicians above all. I'll choose the group. As you wish. The tower is tall and without entrances. To take it down, we must get inside. And to get inside, one of us must climb. It's high and sheer stone. And without me, there is no chance to get in, even if you reach the top. That's a blatant lie. I can climb it. How? Just launch. You're sure you know where it is? I know exactly, Squire. You won't regret this. We cross the bog, we storm the tower, we kill Shamsuk. The group is full. I'll have to ask someone to stay behind. Why don't we speak to them? I will. Why not speak to them now? All right. Settle things here, and then meet me by the road. All right. I'll go with her. Alaron, the tower is waiting. 
Let's meet outside and figure out who to leave behind. Okay, that's where I'll end my session. Once you step back out the door, another cutscene ensues, and the person you have to kick out to let Neeson join will leave. In this case, it'll be Keelan, but that'll be next session. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you later.